Speaking on constitution reform, Prime Minister of St. Vincent and the Grenadines, Dr. Ralph Gonzalez, says his country printed 15,000 copies of the country's constitution and sold them for $2 each. He says the Constitution Review Committee then held town meetings to explain to the public the faults of the existing constitution and to explain what they wanted to change. It also sought to get the views of members of the public, although he says it opened the floodgates. The rest of man wants the holy herb to be legalized in the constitution. Some people want it to be put in the constitution that you, you don't um, inoculate children. Despite the number of varying views, he says that this was still the route preferred above a draft, like what's being done in Trinidad and Tobago. We prefer to do it that way than to start with a draft and then give the people the draft. We thought it was better to get all of these ideas first. And he outlined plans as well to strengthen the judiciary. We are strengthening the rule of law by moving away from the Privy Council to the Caribbean Court of Justice. Every day in our courts we deliver the oxygen of justice. We have competent people, our courts, the CCJ, is more insulated from political interference than the courts in the United States or indeed in the United Kingdom. Dr. Gonzalez will seek a third term in office in elections soon. He says the success of the constitutional reform could decide his fate.